Hello everyone, this is Rex from Petronovich Gaming. Back again with a StarCraft game. This is a 4v4 sent in by uh, Shadow Cat again. He uh, sent me in another replay and I said I would cast replays I received. Therefore, I will. Looks like we got a ping from um, Beowulf over here on this team. This is going to be a 4v4 Hots match. So yeah, let's see what we got. Let's uh, go through our players here. Over here we have Sharkhead, the Blue Protoss. Next to him we have Shadow Cat. Oh, that is the Shadow Cat, the guy I like to cast with a lot. And you have a uh, Bramble, the <laughs> there's Shadow Cat going with. I'm gonna cheese a little. All right, that's typical him. And then we have Zayit, I think. Over here on the other team we have. Uh, Demoldor. <laughs> Asking if he's canon Russian. Something like that. Um, over here we have Alden Rall, another Protoss player. And then we have over here Amor, the orange Terran. Gonna be representing me and my colors. And then we have uh, Beowulf, the green Protoss, who's moving over here. For some reason. Why is he, um, he's attacking his own allies, uh, units there, um, kinda looks like, uh, kinda looks like there's some, uh, disagreements going on, uh, for, uh, for the left team here. Looks like the Terran is deciding not to be phased by this, but he's going again for some more. I don't know what Beowulf is doing, but there appears to be a lot of fighting between this team with the manual attack moves, and there's the probe from uh, Nate there. He's bringing it down. Um, Nate, Nate's a little confused as there's why there's no um, probes at that nexus, but he's going to come down here and see him. Just going right by that little uh, fight there. I think he's going to go right to uh, in between the two Protoss bases which is an ideal spot unless he wants to go up here no he, you should be building the cannon rush over here in between the two protoss there's nothing up here there's no workers up here what are you doing there's he's he, all the probes all the workers are down here every single one okay except for that one that just built if cannon rush succeeds we'll rush them okay yeah, looks looks like uh looks like the team over here is uh building up quite nicely. We got two uh pretty solid wall offs with the cannon. I'm not sure I think um I think that's actually completely walled in right now. Um looks like the cannon rush over here will be successful. Um I'm not sure how this Terran is still surviving without workers, but he's continuing to build. We got a million cannons over here. Um, little does Bramble know that there was a bit of a civil war for this team over here. Uh, looks like there's a counter cannon. It's a cannon. So, okay, looks like it's cannon versus cannon down here. This this whole game is just degrading. Uh, I think he's trying to cannon contain the cannon rush. It's like Beowulf left the game after completely killing his partner. So that now normally you'd say, man, that's a that's a pretty good thing for uh for our team. Like uh, the right team over there got someone to leave. No, that's it's just better for the left team, who was losing another person. So it looks like this counter cannon, it, right team is feeling pretty good about themselves right now. Red is the real MVP <laughs> with the cannon rush. When we got the purple coming around behind. Gonna take out the pylon to try to stop the barracks is my only is my only guess right there. Uh, looks like the cannon contain is not going as well as it as well as it would like to be. There is still a command center floating here if someone wants to get rid of that. Uh, that probe is going to the wrong side of town, doing five damage to that uh five damage to that the marine there. Uh, looks like we got more marines streaming in. Uh, the cannons are continuing. He's trying to. He's trying to take the cannons out with more cannons. Looks like there's a hundred thousand pings right there. 
You can build units, Shadowcat! You don't need to only build cannons, units exist in the game! I mean, not only did you cannon rush the, um, the- The only ones without workers actually mining, but now you're trying to kill cannons with cannons and it's just not gonna work! And where- Where is this command center going? Excuse me! Where are you going? Where do you think you're going? I- Okay. Are you trying to get shot by cannons? Is that what you're trying to do? As long as you're happy. There goes, uh, there goes Shadowcat there, bringing in more, uh, bringing in more of the cannons. Another wave of Marines streaming in. Uh, looks like we have three Marines built over here for, uh, whoever's controlling Amor's forces. Uh, looks like this command center is about to start getting burned down. That Marine unrelenting and still... It's still, um, insisting on going over the cannons. We had a mothership core here to defend the base. We had a warp prism out of sight here. How many gates does he have? He has four gateways right now. I think he's trying to warp in units, and he has over here. I think that was a Dark Templar over there, but I could not be certain. I didn't see it. Yeah, probably Dark Templar. Uh, that command center is going to burn down. Without any hopes of repair, as I don't believe there's a single SCV left for that team. Uh, looks like the Zealots, uh, ran into the cannons, which is now dividing the base in half. If you've ever seen an overcommit on cannons, man, this is one. But it, the, the strange thing is, it's working! It's not even an overcommit, every cannon has served its worth! Normally you'd be building something back on it, but when two of them have already left, what are these guys gonna do? They're stuck in their base right now! No ability to do anything, but the Zealots are pushing back. They took out the wall. The base is no longer divided in half, but there appears to be another pylon back here. We got more of the purple marines trying to take out that one. That one pylon powering all the cannons. All the cannons are going to go down now. Looks like we got some Zealots coming over as well, along with a uh, warp prism out of Sharkhead. Sharkhead wants to come and join the fun. I believe uh, Zeit here is looking for any um, any sort of expansions. Because they saw that command center go away, but that marine can is uh, keeping an eye on it. Uh, looks like the marines are going to kite these zealots. But that's kind of hard to kite zealots when they're stalkers on the field. Amor has no forces anymore because his uh, command center burned down and he left the game. Looks like we have three stargates on the way for uh, four out of Zate here. He just finished four stargates. He's going to try to one base some uh, void rays would probably be my guess. We got some stalkers out of Sarkhead here, which are just going to come in here and dominate. He has no counter to him. Uh, do we, we have a mothership core out of Alder? He needs a mothership core right now. That could buy him a little more time to do something. Looks like, uh... Looks like Sharkhead and Bramble are trying to buy time for Shadowcat here so he can set up more cannons. Uh, looks like, uh... Yes, yeah, Sharkhead's got his, uh... Sharkhead's got his warprism down here. Just, uh, warping in more units. It uh, looks like it's double prone from both sides. The stalkers don't stand a chance. Uh, the, what are, the zealots shouldn't have even arrived. You say your life for ire as soon as you enter the game, but you shouldn't have entered the game. You should have just quit. You should have just quit your job before you, uh, before you even, uh, before you even stepped out of that gateway. Should have just quit your job. And there he goes, leaving the game. Now there's only one left. Now he's got a mother Shakur and a couple cannons. So he has a he has a decent setup right now, but I'm not sure how he expects to 1v4 off a of one base. Look at all these cannons. He built his first gateway in his base too. There's the zealot. That is his first zealot. He the only thing he built back home was a forge. There's the first unit that Shadowcat has built right now. He's also teching here. No, he's just building two more gateways. All the probes are going down. Looks like we got another mass of marines here. I don't know why, um, Demolitor is so, uh, optimistic right now. I would not be at all optimistic about how this game is going. Looks like we even have Void Rays on the field. I don't know why he needed four Stargates. I don't think he even used all four. He only had two Stalkers. Why do you have four? Gateways! What did you think you were gonna produce? Did you think you were gonna produce that many? Oh, those stalkers. Those, they're just gonna overpower. I don't see any way that Demolinator could win. Unless there's a mass internet drop on all of right team's uh, internet. I 
Uh, he needs the photon overcharge right now. He needs the photon overcharge. The Marine should be focusing on that mothership core. He needs the photon overcharge on the Nexus right now. Photon overcharge. You had full energy, you fool. I, I don't know. Photon overcharge with the bottom time. But, okay, the first mistake they, their team made was having an ally like this guy come down here and kill all these workers. Shadowcat made it to Gateway Tech, and he's finally producing four vorders at once. Probably saved up all those minerals for it. Well, I'm going to leave this episode here. Um, as always, like and subscribe if you enjoyed. And also, you can send in your replays to, uh, to me, so that I can cast them. You send it to, uh, the email, patronovichgaming, as spelled like the channel, at gmail.com. Just send it as an attachment, and I can, uh, work with it there. So if you have a replay you want to send in, any kind of replay, or any lighter replay, don't send in, like, a custom game you did. But if you send, if you have any lighter replay of any size, send it in. 4v4s, 3v3s, 1v1s. FFAs even. You can send in free-for-alls if you really want to. But whatever game you want to send in, just send it in at uh, patronovichgaming at gmail.com and I will look at it. Um, and I'll, I'll say that until I get so many replays that I cannot look at all of them. So, uh, as always, like and subscribe if you enjoyed. And until next time, this has been Rex, signing off. Later, guys. <laughs> oh, jeez, I can't stop drop and roll when there's... You are not allowed to have fun. Cease and desist. X, 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 X,